the most delicious and easy vegetable recipe I've ever eaten. To start our recipe, I will cut two carrots into thin slices, this way I'm doing. Then, and I will add olive oil in a pan, I will also add an onion in small cubes and three cloves of garlic well crushed, I added our carrot slices, and I will add a teaspoon of salt and half teaspoon of black pepper. I will stir well until our ingredients are at this point. This recipe is wonderful! Next, I will cut three potatoes into small pieces. That way right here. I'll put our potatoes in a pan and then I'll add plenty of water. A teaspoon of salt and I'll leave until they cook well. Now, I'm going to cut one broccoli into small pieces. I'm sure this recipe will impress you, I was very impressed myself. Then I will pass our broccoli to a pan. I will add plenty of water and then I will add 50 milliliters of milk. I will leave until our broccoli is well cooked and then I will remove them from the water and pass to a container that can go to the oven. And before I forget, tell me which city you're watching so I can send you a special hug. Today's hug goes to Linda Loans Hooper from Canada. I'm glad you're enjoying our recipes. I'll also add our carrot slices and our potatoes. This recipe will be part of your routine, so delicious that it stays. In a container, I will add 170 grams of yogurt, a teaspoon of salt, half a teaspoon of black pepper, a teaspoon of oregano and a little olive oil. I will stir well until our ingredients are completely mixed. Now, I'm going to add our yogurt mix to our recipe. I will stir well to add the flavor of our mixture in all ingredients. This is one of my favorite recipes since I first made it. On top, I'll add a tomato cut into large cubes. And to finish, I will add mozzarella, and as I really like mozzarella, I will add a lot here. I'll bake for 20 minutes at 200 degrees. Now our recipe is ready. Saw how we managed to make a wonderful recipe with few ingredients. I have no doubt that you will come back here to thank me for teaching you to make this recipe. I hope you enjoyed this recipe. Thank you so much for watching this video so far, I see you in the next video. Bye!